All right, another issue new people often encounter with Scratch Live, especially the CDJ users or people that use CD players, is how come when they load a track, and we'll just load any old track, it has a minus time right here. And if you put the needle at the beginning of the vinyl or you press play on your CDJ, uh, the timer, it plays and it starts counting down, but you don't see any waveform here. And the negative time actually counts up. Uh, so what is causing this issue? Well, in the setup menu on the vinyl control tab, there are these two knobs right here labeled vinyl start offset. These were implemented mainly for the vinyl DJs to prevent uh, Q burn on their control records, because obviously with Scratch Live you're using the same record for every song you play. And you know, as vinyl DJs, they like to put the needle at the beginning and you know, scratch it and cue it up and whatnot, and back cue to the beginning, and that causes Q burn on vinyl. So those knobs were uh, implemented to uh, push the start of the track further into the vinyl, so effectively uh, skipping over the cue burn part on the vinyl. Uh, however, this causes some confusions and issues with the new users. I'm um, a little hesitant to say problem because it's not really a problem. Scratch Live is working as it should. Uh, people just don't know all the ins and outs of all the options and whatnot. Uh, but anyway, so. Uh, what you're going to want to do is turn these knobs back down to 0, uh, 0, 0, and 0. Uh, this first knob controls the minutes. The second knob controls the seconds. So uh, just so FYI, you can move the vinyl anywhere up to 10 minutes and uh, basically 11 minutes, 59.4 seconds, uh, into the vinyl or CD. So if your tracks are starting with a negative time and you have to scroll really far into the vinyl or the CD, to get it to begin playing, uh, check the vinyl start offset knobs in the side of menu, and if they are turned up, just turn them back down to the left until they're both on zero for each one, and then your tracks will load and start at the beginning of the vinyl or CDJ as you should expect them to. Uh, so that is the problem, the vinyl start offset knobs, make sure they are on zero and zero.